I'm gonna do a real quick lure overview. Uh, this is a brand new lure. Um, weirdly, my local tackle shop, uh, Brazos River Outdoors, got them before just about anybody else that I know of. Um, was really excited when I went in there and saw them. Uh, I believe it won best of iCast 2015, and if you keep up with iCast, you know exactly what lure I have here. Uh, but yeah, we'll go ahead and show it. It's the live target uh, sunfish or bluegill. Uh, topwater lure basically this is a um, kind of soft plastic frog type bait but uh, in a bluegill shape uh, has trocar hooks on it uh, really really sharp um, of course you know if you've used trocar how they work uh, about the same size as your standard frog uh, this particular one is a 5 8 ounce I believe the other one I get no I did get 5 8 in the other one uh, $12.99, a little bit higher than what you'd probably pay on Tackle Warehouse. Uh, but again, to support uh, the local shop around here, I, I don't mind paying an extra dollar or so. Uh, plus, the fact that they had them before anybody else, uh, I'm good with paying it. So, we'll go ahead and pull this one out. Uh, I've actually pulled one other one out of the box. So I've already had a little, little bit of a experience with them, but pretty neat little baits. Okay, so got it out of here again. Perfect little uh, sunfish shape here. Lots of detail on the body. You can feel the scales aren't just painted on, they're actually on there. You can see uh, the trocar hooks here. Pretty weedless until you actually get down on it. And then look, look how super sticky that is. Yeah. So again, on the other side here, the rest of the detail, you have the actual weight there that comes from the hook. These are, I mean, these are really, really impressive baits. They're not cheap, not cheap at all. But as you can see, the detail on everything, uh, that's why they're not cheap. And you have a little tail here. Again, soft plastic, just like a frog. So that whenever that fish gets on there, pushes down on it, that's when it gets in those hooks. And ouch, they are really sharp. There's your line tie on the front there. It's just amazing the detail into it. It's very impressive. Very, very impressive. So there's that color. I'll go ahead and pull out the other color and show it to you. A picture there. I uh, believe, let's see, what color is this? I don't recall exactly what color we got here. Okay, this one is Midnight Bluegill, uh, metallic Midnight Bluegill. And uh, the one that we're about to show here is Blue Yellow Pumpkin Seed. Uh, really, I got this one to kind of look like a, a tilapia for squaw or a crappie for granberry, which both tend to have similar colorings. Uh, crappie are a little more gray. Tilapia do have a little more blue in them. But what I like, what I like about this one was the chartreuse on the side, give you a, a little more color on it. But again, as you can see here, just the detail on these lures are awesome, awesome. Another thing I like about these, as opposed to just your standard soft plastic frog, is generally on the bottom of a frog, you just have a plain boring color or you have to add your own color. But here, I mean, this looks like a bluegill floating across the top of the water. Um, how it's actually going to perform, I don't know. Uh, I, I was a little bit skeptical because, I mean, when have you ever seen a bluegill skip it across the top of the water? I, I know I've seen them sitting there floating and dying, but I've never seen a bass eat one. Um, but maybe just if you give them the right movement, these will work. But at any rate, the, I mean, these are quality, quality lures. Very, very impressed with them. I can see why they won a lure of the show at iCast or whatever award it might have won. Uh, but yeah, again, this is a live target uh, sunfish soft plastic topwater lure. You can see here. Two of them. Uh, go check them out. They're, again, they're not cheap. About eleven, twelve dollars a piece, thirteen depending. Uh, actually, that's weird. I got no. Okay, yeah, thirteen dollars for these. But yeah, I paid thirteen for them. I'm pretty sure you can get them for around eleven or twelve. But yeah. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Really appreciate it, and we'll see you next time.